This is the Howard Stern Show. Hey, everybody, what's going on? Terrific singing. <clears throat> Where's this guy? Somebody ought to sign him. He's on American Idol. I think he's about to win. It's Mark Harris' is, uh, brilliant rendition of, of what, Robin? My, my, uh, what is it? That's a Rico Martin song. Right? Good. La Vida. La Vida Loca there. <laughs> What's the matter with this guy? Mark Harris is back again. Oh. Dear President Clinton, <laughs> I did write this song for you to thank you on behalf of Martha Ray. I know we had our problems. I can't take it. I don't even know why I invited him on the show. <laughs> Terry said it's been a long time since Mark Harris showed up. And why don't we put him on? And it seemed like a good idea in the meeting. And then. And now you have to deal with the reality of it. You now he's here. <laughs> he's in the superstition. Maybe we'll hold some focus groups of black people. They can listen to that and tell us whether it's funny. <laughs> it would be funny to tape. Good luck. Yeah. I'd like to be the person at the front who plays the tape. All right, here's Mark Harris, who claims he's having a big meeting today to get his own radio show, which is no way he is. Michael Jackson's <laughs> not a talk. Hallelujah. <laughs> ah, there's my hero, Mark Harris, in orange. He's the only person who would wear that color. Yeah. There's only one. It's a, I thought the leisure suit died yes. years ago. Look at that. Get up He's on the bringing fashion. it back. Yeah. Is leisure suit back? Good morning. <laughs> Is leisure, yeah. How are you, Mark? How are you? Good. Is the leisure suit back in? According to the 70s shows. Well, it was just made. So I guess it's back. Most people don't want you on the show. I think you know that. The, this show? This show. Not according to my fan mail, the email. Yeah. No. Uh, be honest. How much honest. fan mail do you get a day? Check the counter. It's legit. What counter? Where would I check a counter? www.akamarkharris.com. And there's a counter that yeah, counts your email? Been, yeah. www.akamarkharris.com. Thanks for the plug. And on that, you count your there email. There is a counter. Yeah. How many people log on to the site, you mean? Yeah. Yeah. How many visit? Yeah. How many visitors do you get a day to your website? I don't know by the day. There's a counter that goes by the year. All right. How many visitors a year do you get? Well, um, there's over 22,000 since January. 22,000 hits. Yeah. So it doesn't mean 22,000 people. It means it made me say maniac just keeps going on there. Maybe same it's you maniac, going yeah. on over and over again. Yeah, sure. Right? I know. Yeah, I know. every time he checks it. He checks it 5,000 times a day, I'm sure. Oh, sure. Mark, we've yeah. known you now for, I think, 15 years, 10 years, something like that. Yeah, is this going to get into the old stuff where you're going to put me down? I'm delusional and all that Well, stuff. you are in the sense that yeah. you've not one of your projects has ever bared fruit. You've right. never gotten a TV I show. I wouldn't say it didn't bear fruit. I would. <laughs> no. His mother bared but, a fruit. Uh, no, come on. <laughs> and your mother made an adorable monster. Yes. And you got fatter. What the hell are you eating? Come on. Oh, come on. My I God. lost eight pounds. Oh, try the Suzanne Summers diet. <laughs> so what happens in your mind that makes you think... In my mind. Yeah, that you're going to get a radio show. You've never gotten well, a I TV have, show. No, I have a meeting with a satellite radio today. Serious. With a serious, satellite radio. Serious, yeah. All right. And... And they're serious about this? I think they are. Yeah, and who I contacted really you from Sirius? Uh, Mindy Kramer. I mean, you want names? Yeah. I don't believe a word of it. Well, I don't really I don't think care. you'll ever see a radio show on Sirius. Well, I don't know about that, but I have a meeting. Well, Mark, what happened to, to all of your You speak to people at IBM, so do I. You what? You speak to people at IBM, like yeah. Jeff Schick. I speak to people there, too. <laughs> who do you speak to? Brian Queen. And what does that mean that you speak no, to people? No, what does it mean to you too? I don't know. No, no, no. I, mean, I, I have a project I, like a radio show, and it's actually on the air. Oh, I know that. Right. So, so you've ne you've never gotten one. I'm, it's not a I was down. just listing no, all of your projects you've told us yes. about over the years. The Broadway show. The wait a minute. The Broadway show where I wanted to develop the life story from Martha Ray, the Big Mouth. What happened? 
it wasn't uh, picked up. Okay. Right, but that, that was happening. You it. were having backing parties and all kinds of stuff. It never yes, happened. Uh, Whatever happened to uh, Tasty but, Travels? But what does this mean? <laughs> oh, that, that lunatic knocked it off. I sent it. Uh, through an agent, actually, to the cooking network. And then the next day you have that knocking on the door, and they're doing tasty travels. Do you remember when... But you know something... Oh, right. oh, who's doing tasty but travels? Yeah. Did. Who they did? Called, they called it something else. Oh. Going to people's homes. Going to people's homes? And cooking. <laughs> but what, is the, what does it matter? First of all, you have to understand, I'm, I'm having a great life. No, I know you're having fine. a great life. I'm just saying, at what yeah. point do you say, you know what, I don't think it's going to happen for me? Yeah, do you remember when you were supposed to give us $1,000 a head if you didn't get your hotel up and running within six months? No right. such what thing. I, what? Never, I never said that. So stop stirring it we up. We just didn't take the money. Lie. No. Remember there was a date. Look, was, there, this, no, is all, this rehashing is all crazy. Do you remember I'm a very <laughs> creative person. <laughs> I mean, it's crazy. It's it is crazy. crazy. What about very your good. line of clothing? I'm wearing it. What about the ah, you're the only one. <laughs> what about the stage? No, the baseball jackets were good. What about the stage production of Picture of Dorian Gray? Yeah. It, again, not only it wasn't picked up, but then Robert Evans took it, and he wanted to make it into a movie on oh, his own. Dear. What happened? Public domain. Public domain. Well, his didn't get picked up, too. Why don't you call him? Well, a my lot point of is, but, but Howard, he's got a lot of projects, projects out there right. that never get picked and up. Yours why are, should I just stop if I'm creative? Yours are never picked up. But the, I have a very good cabaret act. Fans come to see me. I have a, a great time doing it. Have you ever said to yourself, I don't think it's in the cards. I'm really not going to get a radio show. I'm really not. It, okay. may, it may never happen. Right. But I do have a meeting. You How do you have a meeting? Do they call you or you they, call them? And you hounded them. I only called one another. I didn't hound them. Okay. Uh, there's um, a guaranteed meeting at 3 o'clock today. What do you want me to Guaranteed meeting. Guaranteed. And what does this woman do at Sirius Radio? She's one of the directors. And they brought in the vice president. I mean, do you see that? How many people there are you meeting with? More important, is there a future in satellite radio? I think there is. I Good. think that satellite radio will be successful not eventually. Not a big one, Marco. But well, I think you sure. could set it back 50 years. No, not with my comedy. <laughs> Your you have comedy. Have some comedy. Gossip and scandals. You have my tabloid CD? What do, do You've we have only that? been playing Michael Jackson. Yeah. Well, you we talk can't about, get past you, that. You talk about J-Lo. I have a song about J-Lo on there. Very funny. You do what track? I'll play it. Six. <laughs> All right, you got me. I'm going to listen to it. Is this what the show is going to be like? But me. Well, I don't want to get. I don't want to discuss it right uh, here. Where is the CD about J Lo? Yeah, I, it, I no, that's more Michael. Of Michael with all of it. <laughs> Go ahead. That's funny too. That's track six. That's track six. Oh, then you got the wrong one. Andrea's in the green room with the right one. Tell her to come in. Who's Andrea? My assistant. All right. Well, will you say that like I'm supposed to know? Have I ever met oh, your you sister? Did. You I did. have. Yeah. You even said kind words to her. Like, Mark's <laughs> your best guess. That's just what you said to her. Did I say that? Yes, you did. <laughs> and you were in stones. <laughs> true, true, true. How big is the Mark Harris payroll besides Andrea? Who else is on it? Do you have, like, stylists? Well, I fired Mamacita. Who's that? Oh, uh, the woman that got you when you fell down when you were sick? Yeah, yeah. The, the Hispanic housekeeper. Yeah, she's gone. She was legal, though. She Why is she gone? gone? Well, I, uh, I, I don't even want this guy. She's a little off. I see. You're not? No, no. I'm fine. I'm fine. If he thinks she's crazy, she must be way out there. No, no, no. Oh, she's way out. She, oh, but the best burritos. Mark, do you have, you have a gardener? Yes, I do. And a, and a housekeeper? Even though you got rid of Mamacita, you have a new one. Right? Not a live-in. Now I have one that just... And a personal visits. assistant? Yes. Driver? Yes. Wow. What else wow. are you wasting Martha Ray's money on? Uh, it may surprise you I have my own. Wow. Wow. Well, is the house still red, white, and blue? Not everybody loses money in the stock market. I can't believe you have your own money. Is the house still red, white, yeah. and blue? Yes, it is. All right. Go visit at the, wes uh, the website. I hear his neighbors no are completely freaked well, out. Not video. all of them. I saw a great videotape. You did some sort of a, um, a patriotic American show in front of your house. O to B, yeah, on the Oxygen o Network. O to B? Yeah. On the Oxygen Network? Yeah. It aired on Oxygen. Uh, quite a few times. Yeah. Your special. Not my special. What is it? What, what aired on Oxygen? My house and me interview. Oh, oh yeah, I they see. interviewed. Yeah. Oh, you say, as a matter of fact, you said that would never happen. You said that would never happen. No, I didn't say that yes, wouldn't happen. But, uh, people are going to interview you. You're, 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 you're no, a train wreck. No, no you did. Of course, that. they're going to interview you. They're goofing on when you. You don't you. even know they're goofing on you. That's goofing. what's so sad. As long as they're laughing, there's nothing sad. You know, you there think is it. nothing sad except the world condition. All right, we have the J Lo song. Let's listen. That's good. This, is, this makes me feel gay. J-Lo, you know, marries, although Affleck is such a wow. She'll take her vow 
then we'll say and what is how. This? I don't even know what you're talking about. Why don't you listen? What does that mean? Why don't you listen? I can't handle it. It's wedding. horrible. You know, her upcoming worse wedding. The normal for him. Mark, no, stop it. It's, it's horrible. Yeah. What do you pay? Like, do you. You, that's what do you get into a studio with a musician and Leo DeLion who's there today <laughs> doing the Robert Blake number that I got oh to record boy. Thursday that's outrageous what is that all about I'll mail it to you Thursday thank you and then you can make fun of that yeah Vinny go Not ahead Robert Blake of me right? Vinny go ahead Howard you know how uh, Mark usually does songs from the 1920s and 30s yeah he's, he's updating his repertoire he's up to the 50s uh, play his version of Rawhide he, oh, he, no. He it What's with the Rawhide? Mark, it's a great performance. Rawhide? I love it. What's what rawhide? track would that be? I think it's track That's four, right, Mark? I never did Rawhide. Track four. I believe it, the chiller. Uh... This one? No. No, no. You know the... the... Rawhide. Me, da, na, 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 na. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He does a... Rawhide. Keep them nuggets no, rolling. No, He's joking. No, I'm not joking, Mark. It's a well, great I song. didn't record it. Hey, is he kidding? You know, why don't you do something useful and like? tell our audience how to get rich marrying old women? <laughs> I mean, really, give us the secret. Well, you spoke about a few before, but you left out Joan Fontaine, Olivia de Havilland. Are That's those on your radar? <laughs> <laughs> Mark oh, got a lot of now money. Now it's radar. It used to be gaydar. <laughs> Boy, Mark, Mark, how much money do you have right now? I don't know. I didn't look, Vinny. A million? Um, I don't think I have enough uh, like you do. You know, I know my house is worth Are you a millionaire? Uh, well, people do say that, you know. People say that or you yeah, say that? Yeah, I don't go around saying that, no. All right. He wouldn't say that. Well, but hey. where's his uh, friend? What was that guy with the... Boris. He, he's a millionaire. Boris. He's you still dating him? Well, I don't go to Europe these days. Right. You're not going to Europe? Mm, nope. No. So you're not having sex or you're meeting men? Why do I... I can't have sex in my own bed. Are you meeting men? And I'm meeting women, too. You're having oh. sex with women? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No way. What's so surprising? I doubt it. You could doubt it all you want. I don't believe it. Are you it. having sex, period? Yes. With who? Beth. Oh, who's Beth? My girlfriend from for three years. <laughs> oh, well, yeah, b -b 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 my girlfriend, wait, a girl. Mm. No penis. Oh, well, my ex-wife doesn't have a penis either. <laughs> oh, she probably does, but... but uh, no, she doesn't. Your ex-wife, Morris? Your... <laughs> no. No. <laughs> that poor woman. Are you having sex at all, Artie? <laughs> yeah. With what? A calzone? A, a chick. A the calzone. chick. I, like I the, shouldn't uh, think I so. I'd like to have a calzone during it. Yeah, I bet you would. You are a calzone. <laughs> now, where's this rawhide, I suppose? you got to play it. What is it? Give us the Mark, track number. Mark, it's on your gossip CD. Yeah, but I never did rawhide. Howard, ever since he started playing Hallelujah, he's cut five more CDs. Of Hallelujah? <laughs> oh, no, no. I, does he mean the Chilla song? I, I, it's on the Chilla CD. We got about 50 different more Yeah, show it songs. to me. Okay. I think You mean Chilla, don't you? Yes, you did two versions of Rawhide. The second one is That's the better not one. It. See Andrea in the other room. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Andrea. Andrea. Is she Mark, is the right problem now. that you're cutting so many records that you don't even know what you're cutting at this point? No. You see, Vinny, Vinny, Vinny asked me to keep it coming, keep it coming, send it to him on his express. I've been doing it <laughs> as a favor, but now it's mastered. And Andrea, would you bring in the master? Vinny listens to all this stuff. I know. Vinny's a Mark Harris expert. He calls my office every 10 case, minutes. Sir. You would think I work for him. What, what does he pitch you? More shows? He pitches me shows. He asks me to send CDs that he sends to me to Sirius. I don't know why he can't send them himself. I think he tricks them into thinking it's coming from me. He's in a discussion now with Casey about his various CDs. Like a pyramid scheme. See Andrea. See Andrea. Have yeah. you had more work done, Mark? I'm just staring at him. I just, I'm I know. fascinated. His face is morphing. Oh. Did you have more work? More work? No. Tell the truth. I just did. We should get this things on. Mark has a better face. No more work. What, plastic surgery? Yeah. Yeah. No, no. Nothing. Not Nothing. No. All right. You like the gray hair? It looks better now. Better, yeah, better yeah. than the black hair. Yeah, the black hair was a little fake. Yeah, where do you think I did more work? I lost weight, but I didn't have more work. I, I could see those scars on the side of your face and stuff, and your, yeah. eye, and your eyes seem to appear to be going back more and more. <laughs> that, that's like a Boris, Chinese woman. The Boris Karloff look. Right. Yes. Hey, I was just talking to Mark's assistant, and she says that he's an incredible pain in the ass, and she wants to yell at him. Good. Oh, tell yeah, her to come good. in. Tell her to come in and say that. Another one off the payroll. Oh, boy. You're going to fire her after today? <laughs> she wouldn't say that. Come on in. What, 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 uh, hi, how are you? It's so good to see you. Finally, a woman who makes some sense. <laughs> yeah, what's it like to be Mark Harris's assistant? <clears throat> Is it horrible? 
Is it horrible? You look like you're going to cry. <laughs> and I don't blame That's you. That's because she's in a good mood. Is it a nightmare walking around with him? I just gave Casey KC. the CD, and you're yelling for the CD. It's like, do you pay attention? I didn't hear anything. I, but I just gave it to him. The J Lo, they just played it. That yes, no, no. But they're asking for something I never recorded. Rawhide. And he does sleep with women, not he, me. Really? I'm a butter body, not big enough. He he, uh, he sleeps with women. You've seen them. Are they old women? Well, I'm going with everyone. a I'm going with a very beautiful woman to the SAG Award Sunday. And you banged her. The You've SAG. Had sex not with this. Year. No, it happens. I swear, I can vouch. Really? I told you last summer. I said I've been to the house. But why is the focus my sex life? I don't understand. Because what are we going to talk to you about? <laughs> Nobody cares. These about projects, it. Really these fantasy projects. What would you yeah. like us to talk to you about? What is the fantasy interview that you have in your head that we're going to ask? You? Fantasy interview. Yeah, Wait, bring up Sean good. Penn. Oh, Did you bang Sean no. Penn? No, 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 he's probably. I don't like to talk about. For I don't like Penn. to talk about treasonous. Really, treasonous. I, yes, you have the right to protest here in our country, but why go visit the enemy? All right, there you go, Mark. Uh, making some sense for a second. Interesting. Should I make a song out of that? What is it, Casey? All right, so we got the one that, that Vinny's talking about. It's it's the intro to Chiller. Right. That's what he calls rawhide. Okay. All right, let's hear it. It's track track one. Can't be track one. Yeah. Oh, hey, it's rawhide. They used to call him the king of pop. Then he turned into the king of flop. If you thought it could never get worse, well, it did. Because now he's the king of schlock. When Michael Jackson made his thriller, it was great. And now, I hope you enjoy my chiller. You know what's funny about this guy? If Michael Jackson called him today... He'd he, be right there. He'd be his best friend. Oh, no. sure. Are you, you serious? absolutely no would. Wrong. No way, oh, wrong. are you wrong? You're wrong. No way. You would love him. No, I wouldn't. You would. You'd love to hang out I, in Neverland. No. You would be right there. You got it. Absolutely. Kidding. I don't even go to Coney Island for the You're rides. a star effer. You love. No, no. wrong. Really? Well, you're, boy, you're wrong. I don't think so. Well, you're Rob, taking Rob, am I wrong. right? I think that Michael could persuade him. He'd I love don't to think be there. So. Never. Between him and Pee Wee Herman, no. No. I wouldn't. They're too weird for you. Weird. You don't mean you get it's it wrong what they do. Yeah. God knows what you do. Bisexuality is not a wrong thing. No, 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 no. Bisexuality is not someone underage is. Who is this he's dating? He, he does he date women or does he? Oh he's my all over the God! Line? I'm telling you, he's all over the place. So you'll see him with a guy one night and a girl the next night. His sex life is equal to his career. A regular revolving it's, door. It's Never everything. It's yeah. embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> Any port in a storm. Really? <laughs> and you should see the returns. But he's he's actually a wonderful man. Really? You shouldn't goof on him. <laughs> oh, please, please, please. After you goof on him. <laughs> okay. How come you can? Because I live in his house half the year. I see. All right, Vinny, go ahead. One last question for Mark. And uh, Mark is here to promote, I guess, a.k.a. MarkHarris.com. And he, and he wants everyone to know he's having a big meeting with hey, serious no, no, I want them to buy the tabloid show. CD. <laughs> can you buy it? Yes. Okay, it's for On sale. On the website, yeah. Mark. Yes. Mark, what is it that your son does? I remember you telling me I was surprised. I have a what son that lives in China. Is that what you're talking it, about? And what does he do? Yeah. He gets away from Mark. He couldn't get far He's enough. He's the administrator of an English-speaking school because he speaks Chinese. If Mark was your dad, wouldn't you move to China? Yes. With no one knew you? <laughs> He's currently trying to find the furthest point from the United States. <laughs> oh, just get out your Imagine address. That's the furthest point. His father's point. Mark. He's pretending to be Chinese. <laughs> not at six, six foot four. He's not. He's the tallest white man there. Does he go with guys and girls or just girls? No, he's straight. He's straight. He's just into girls. Especially Oriental girls. Right. Oh my God! Right, big time. I mean, what's up? <laughs> what's up? <laughs> what's up? I'm glad. Right. Well, uh, is he a good-looking boy? Yeah. Good-looking kid. Yeah. Does he have anything to do with you? Yes, of he course. Does. He calls you. He speaks to you. Of course. I'm why, shocked. Why are you shocked? Yeah, I would just think he'd be. Do you know alert. that I just did a cabaret show and my daughter was in it playing Winona Ryder? <laughs> Taking true. everything off the tables with sack shopping bags while I sang uh, the Winona Ryder song. Wow. That's she funny, did great. Who she did great. It? Who needs to take acid? You hang out with Mark. <laughs> you don't need uh, drugs. Absolutely. absolutely. You think you're hallucinating. So, Mark, the, the, uh, to sum it up, because everybody wants to know how you yes. were doing. In all seriousness, you yes. put out a CD. Yes. 
You're not going well, to Europe. Well, you made the box set pretty good. You know, they used, they used to go for one. Now they're ordering the box set. Good. All right. So your box set is out. Your songs. Is at the Colony the Records. CD. Your Chiller CD. Now the Chiller will be out in a week. And what is that? All Michael Jackson songs? No. no. What I did, uh, there's so many celebrities and scandals. You'll have Robert Blake Thursday, Vinny. I would say, well, actually, you'll have it Friday. It's really good. Leo's in the studio uh, this afternoon. In the Mastering day. it? Yeah. It's really good. Well, I'll step into it. It's great. The Robert Blake thing is a hoot. All right. And so that's what you're doing professionally. Gossip and scandals, uh, talk, you know, singing about all the gossip. Okay. So when you have this meeting today, what mm. will you present then? Yeah, what is going to be the show that you... Well, they already have the CDs. This uh, show is gossip and scandals. It's comedy. And music. All right, so you'll be on satellite radio. I hope so, if we sign the deal. I see. And you'll do what? You'll talk about gossip? Right, exactly. We right. sing. Of course I'll sing. I wouldn't miss an opportunity to hit an F. Uh, no, I would. <laughs> well, there you, you go. I mean, the guy is on a roll. What? <laughs> and that's, with, <laughs> that's without Sesame. My he, guess he's is... a very good singer. He is. Yeah. Are you, are you I sir? don't know why he always sounds awful on the air. Because he really <laughs> can sing. But not, what, but I'm you serious. You know that... Sing something right now. <laughs> sing something. Uh, sing a cappella. Uh, sing them. a song for Melissa Rivers. Melissa Rivers, sing a song? Yeah. Like, her bra. Does he have a song about Melissa Rivers' yeah. bra? Not yet. Wait, wait a couple minutes. Not yet. <laughs> oh, <laughs> free, he can freestyle. He free, freestyle, right? Yeah. yeah, do a rap. Honor us with a song right now. Short song, please. How, how about a rap? All right, a rap. A rap. All right. Dedicate a rap. to Suzanne Summers. You know, that's how I lost the weight. She's really great. Okay, go ahead. So you're hungry and your cupboards are bare, and there isn't any food to eat. Now it's lunchtime when you look around, cause your kitchen's looking clean and neat. You start thinking that you'll go for fast food, but the walk is gonna kid your feet. Just you watch Suzanne Summers, and you're gonna learn how to cook and eat. All right, well, you there you more? go. You want no, more? I, I think well, I had enough. <laughs> you like that jingle? Nice. So does Suzanne. Well, Mark Harris yeah. wants you to buy his CD at aka markharris.com, Robin. He is on his way to an exciting meeting with Sirius Radio. I'm just amazed. He has a box set. Box set. Oh, I have the box set. All right. You want to see? How many have you sold? Have you really sold any? I did. I did. Yeah. No, I really did. Yeah. I press a thousand at a time. That's the minimum you right. press. And the Let Him Eat Pork CD is in the second uh, pressing. <laughs> Anything else? Yes. That's my advice to the Arabs. He's on the SAG Awards Sunday. Oh, yes, yeah, Sunday on the, on red, the red carpet. carpet. People magazine, the whole show. Really? Yeah. You will do what? What will you do on the red carpet? Well, I was one of the voters. be thrown off. No, I was one of the voters for the films. Oh. And it's interesting how I was picked. You know, they pick you from the lottery. Right. I had joined SAG on that last show of, um, of yours on FX. Okay. And three months later... They picked me. People for many years haven't been picked. And then after you finish the voting and you send in the ballot, they pick uh, who can go to the parties and the after parties and all this. And my name was picked. So Mark will be appearing at the SAG after parties, Robert. Oh, boy. All right. That should you, be Do fun. you have any jobs open here? For who? For you? Yeah. Yeah, you've got to get another job. Go to China. <laughs> you got to. Well, she's bi-coastal. She'd prefer to live here. Well, there's your update on Mark Harris. He uh, married, we first learned of him when he married an 80-year-old woman, That's right. Martha and Ray. He's looking for another one. Okay. But they heard more of me from you. Have you. Are you dating anyone famous? Any women? Famous? Yeah. No. No. Rich? Yes. Rich women? One. A guy named Rich. <laughs> one woman, Rich. One rich woman. Mm. Anything else you'd like to know? Will you marry her? No. Is it Lena Horn? No. <laughs> How old is the woman? She's 41. Is that true? Yeah, correct. It is. Mm. Huh. She must, she must be I a I feel this is judgment at Nuremberg here. <laughs> She's got to be desperate. What is going on? Talk politics. She's got to be. She a, Talk what politics. What does she look like? Yeah, is she a train wreck? She's her. a Republican. Is she a train wreck? No, she's quite oh, beautiful. 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 Extreme. And really. Bar Boris isn't an eyesore, is he? No. No. I guess. Uh, yeah. Just oh, needy, needy. needy. The woman doesn't look like Tom Arnold? No, she's not very beautiful. Right. But what is wrong with her? Have what? you taken her to bed? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> not this year. We just reconnected after many years. But you have slept with her in the past? Yes. Yes. I mean, what's the big deal here? I don't, I don't believe it. you could get it up for a woman. Really? I don't. Well, yeah, I don't get it. It's a very hard conversation. Right. Do you believe he could get sex with a woman? Mark, I, I know you for a long time, and Howard yes. asked me a question. Do I believe you can get a, um, an erection from yes. a woman? And I actually don't, because your you kids, don't, because your kids are from a long time ago. And the big excuse no, about, me, my youngest opinion. child. Just an opinion, opinion. Oh. I, the best interest I've ever seen you have has been in men. You know, well, that, uh, well but you, you don't know me gay. personally. Well, no, no, but I, when, the guys that you brought in here, you've been way more excited about than excited. I would say. Well, I don't mean like physically, uh. but I mean I could tell. 
through well, love with a man. Yeah. Well, and maybe I, I, next I think time years I'll ago, bring this lady on. I think years Just, ago, I don't know why. I think years ago. years ago you were closeted. No, and you never. Were probably... No, never. I was bisexual then. I was not closeted. That's not true. Well, you know it's interesting, Howard. One of our interns out there who does who never really heard of Mark before is listening to the interview, and he just had a great line. He said, "You know, this is really fascinating." I, he goes, "This guy lives in this whole other world where he's really important." <laughs> <laughs> Who's important? You. you. Well, you know something, it does surprise me because people like Nicolas Cage and all of them know me. I, I only know of them, you know, from movies. And they all know me. I don't. It's because of you. Nicolas Cage knows George you? Clooney. He George Clooney. George Clooney. George Clooney. But yeah. not personally, no. How do you know they know you? From the show. They let me know. They call you? When I, no, I run into these people. I live in California. <laughs> and now after the Screen Awards and voting... Everyone movies, knows you. You, you, you bang Martha Ray and got her money. Of course everyone knows you. Everyone's read about it. It's a fascinating story. Yeah, it's banged an old it. senile you know, hag. No, to, I mean, know come something? on. That's a fascinating story. Tablo that's how I got fascinated. Tabloids really never give you... You do. They always have an awful so spin. And they have a two-page spread now on Shelley Winters and then my right. name and finally giving my due because, you know, Shelley was put into conservatorship. Her right. daughter right. took her charge cards, <laughs> everything away from her. And uh, they finally say, well, Mark Harris took care of uh, Martha. <laughs> oh, he sure did. <laughs> he sure did. <laughs> you know, oh, she, right. she was a wonderful lady. All right. How, well, many, how many people have so judged Shelley. you by just the stereotype of who you are? No one. Everyone. No, but no, yeah. just people yeah, out there. It's true. People no. in the world do that. Mark, I know it's a, a tortured life, but uh, a tortured life. Well, oh, no. why the torture? I think it's hard. Your music. I think it's no. I think it's hard to <laughs> want to be a woman and not be. I don't oh. want to be a woman. I don't think that's we're a ridiculous a statement. Come on, Mark. Mark. It's a you've ridiculous. You've had a facelift. You, you, you've had a ball. Talk. How many men had facelifts? I don't know of any women. No, Regis Philbin didn't have a facelift. No, but your what do you call that? Your eyes are almost in the back of your head. He's Chinese now. That's no, my no, son no. moved to China. Yeah, because his father's Chinese. <laughs> but if I had all the plastic surgery, the thing is still intact. Right. All right, listen, I'm happy for you. You're, Thank living, you're a happy you. life. Yes, I am. A.K.A. MarkHarris.com is where to go. Good luck with your Thank meeting you. today. Thank I you. know. I know somewhere you'll get a show someday. Thank you. I do know. Oh, and would you stop. guest on it? Um, no. I would no, never appear never. on it. You would, never. But would, you, would you visit? Would you talk? There's not going to be a show. If I there is, but if serious is serious, would you say a few words? If serious no, is serious. I will not. No? It's no, too I won't appear. That's too, it's too wild Is it for too me. extreme? Mark, yeah. congratulations Thank you. on your meeting today. A Thank meeting you. is something. He meets all the time. I know. Yeah, that I do. All right. We've got to take a break, though. We've got to take a break. Well, I'd like to say goodbye to everybody. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, on this Take break, care. after all, this was the good part of the radio. All right. And I want to thank your assistant, who really is she's a great operating lady. under difficulty. Uh, yeah, under, but she's a great lady. Under, under difficulty. Come on, hire me, hire me. Uh, I'll, I'll look into it. You seem very competent. All right, we're going to take a break. And then we'll be back right after these. Uh, how do you keep the music playing? How do you make it last? How do you keep the song from fading to fast?
và hôm nay bên em lại về một chiếc Kia Cerato cái xe sản xuất 2019 bản 1.6 số sàn xe phiên bản màu đỏ đấy Cerato là một trong những dòng phân khúc hạng C của Kia rất là chất con này số sàn và đã bị uh, va quẹt và sườn bên phụ của mọi người nhé vì vậy là có một mức giá rất là ưu đãi tuy nhiên là trước khi báo giá thì em sẽ quay tổng thể chiếc xe các bạn có thể thấy rằng là trong tất cả những dòng thì Kia một trong những dòng mà cùng phân khúc thì nó thuộc dạng rẻ nhất rồi đấy